In this video, I'm going to demonstrate to you on how to do a running stitch. A running stitch is a hand stitch, which is normally used for when you're creating a seam or doing a basting stitch when you don't have a machine. So let's get started. So I'm going to do the running stitch on the scrap piece of fabric that I have, and I'm using uh, embroidery floss, so it's a little bit easier to see for demonstration purposes. What you're first going to do is bring your needle up through from the bottom of the fabric and then back down again about a quarter of an inch. And then you're going to go back up a quarter of an inch and back down. So you're just going to do this for however long that you need to to make a running stitch for. So now I'm going to show you a little bit of a faster way to do this. It's not as accurate, but it's a little bit of a speedier way to, to get this stitch done. For this other method, uh, we're going to start off the same way. I'm going to bring my needle up through my fabric, but I'm not going to bring my needle all the way through. What I'm going to do is bring up just a little bit and go back down, pull it a little bit, and then come back up with my needle and then go down. So basically what I'm doing is I'm gathering it on my needle. Once I've gone some distance, all I need to do now is just pull my needle all the way through. Okay, I'll show you that one more time. So now I'm gonna go up just a little bit, down, up, and gather this onto my needle. Okay, and now I'm gonna pull it all the way through. So, you know, the uniformity doesn't really matter if you're just doing a basting stitch because you're gonna take it out anyways. But if I wanted to use this to create a ruffle or something like that, all I would need to do is just pull these stitches and see how it gathers up. So that's how you do a running stitch.